Hi everybody, how are you? It's your girl Kenya and welcome to my channel, Confessions of a Shopaholic. Hey y'all, how are you doing? Is everything good with you all? Everything is just dandy 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 with me. Your girl is back into the swing of things. I just did my um, makeup sale so I hope you all shopped 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 and got some good things. Um, so yeah, I know I have been, up until, um, the makeup video, I know I have been missing in action for a little while, and that's because I just had so much going on. Um, school has been hectic. I've now moved up from theory to junior stylist, so I'm now working on real, um, <laughs> real people. It's a, it's a trip. I can't believe I'm really a hair dresser. I mean, I've always kind of been into hair, but never really like that and now I'm starting to really like it so I am becoming literally the jack of all trades which brings me to uh, this video this is a haul video but this is not just any haul video this is a collective haul over the last um, two weeks and this is just to show you um, the new projects that I have going on in my life um, some of the new items that I purchased some of the new things that I'm into so this haul is going to be presented a little bit differently when I show you the items I'm going to probably explain a little bit of what they are and why you know what where when why and how so I would first like to take the time out to thank all of my YT sisters for your support thank you to my my current sisters, my new sisters, my old sisters, thank you guys so much for sticking in there, for supporting me, for your concern when I'm gone. People, hey girl, what's going on? How you doing? I, I'm, I'm so appreciative and grateful of that. It keeps me on my toes. Like, I got to get back to my sisters. I got to share my stuff with them. And then, once that happens, I can't stop. Just like now, I can't stop talking because I have so much to share with you guys. Okay, so I'm not going to make this introduction very long. I am just going to get into um, the first part. Okay, so as I stated, I've had um, a lot of things going on, a lot of new changes, a lot of things I've been doing in school. And one of them is I took an airbrush class. So yeah, I'm airbrush certified. And with that certification, I got... A new airbrush machine um, this airbrush machine and certification was through a company called air makeup um, it's owned by a lady named Kathy you can google her if you like so with that came my airbrush compressor and this is a real compressor y'all but it is portable it has a handle which I absolutely love um, also in the kit came um if i can open it i kind of got it smushed came a tanning gun so now i can do um spray tans and then it came with um my regular airbrush gun a hose some spray tan and a couple of um spray foundations you know what guys let me turn my phone down because I don't like getting interrupted in the middle of my videos. But anyway, so um, yeah, I took a um, basic certification course um, with her, which gave me an airbrush certificate. Um, I was already pretty familiar with, with airbrushing. I had a small airbrush system before that, so I was really familiar with the workings of the actual gun. But y'all see this? This is a real legitimate compressor. When my husband saw this, he was like, I could pump my tires up with that thing legitimate compressor okay here's your your, your air gauge um, your on and off switch here is your um, your plug and then here is the um, the air wire or whatever the heck you call that thing and then it all came nicely packaged in this black bag here so that is one of the things that I have added to my resume which I am super duper duper excited about um, the only thing that I really didn't like was her actual makeup and you know your girl keeps it real I'm sorry I am not affiliated with this company in any kind of way I purchased this with my own money and 
speaking of purchase, for the certificate and the machine, I paid $2.99, which is a steal for a compressor like this and those two guns and the, cer the certification. That was um, a deal that she had going on with students, but that was a steal compared to the airbrush machines that you find on um, on the internet now. But anyway, like I was saying, her foundation, I really did not like her foundation. It ran. It didn't stick. It. it I just didn't like it. So if you guys um, want to look her up for her machine, it's www.airmakeup.com, but I would not recommend you buying her makeup. I'm sorry if she ever gets a chance to see this. Sorry, sister girl, but I mean, it is what it is. I have to keep it real. But as far as the machine is concerned, the machine itself is the bomb. It runs well. It is, it's off the hook. I mean, if this thing sprays bodies, sprays tans, then yeah so that was one of the things that i had going on my airbrush system which i'm really really excited about okay so moving on um as i mentioned in my welcome back video i attended the ibs show which is the international beauty show um this past week um with a couple of my classmates i had a flipping ball I can only imagine how IMAX is going to be. When I say there was vendor after vendor after vendor, I mean everything under the sun from makeup to nail care, everything. Okay, so with that being said, you know your girl went ridiculously retarded. So one of the vendors I stopped at, and MBQ, Natural Born Queen, this one is for you. You're going to be so proud of your sister. I'm just saying. Um, Jane Carter Solutions was one of the vendors that was there. Um, I don't know if some of you may remember or not. My husband actually is in the process of growing his dreads out. So I've been looking for like the holy grail of things to lock his hair with to condition it and this that and the third so when I saw them at the show I really liked you know the rundown of her products and I suffer from dry scalp as I've said time and time again so I got a couple things that would suit me and my husband so for myself I got the scalp nourishing serum that goes along with um, the Scalp Renew. So these go together. And these are all natural products. I mean, as natural as natural can get. Then I got um, the Twist and Lock for my husband. And then to go along with it, I got the Natural Hold Locking Spray. Then I got the Revitalizing Leave-In Conditioner and the Hair Nourishing Cream, which is a daily um, gloss for your hair. Then I got the Nourishing and Shine Cream, which it says for dry hair and dry skin, which is a perfect, perfect plus for me. Um, then she gave me a sample of the Curl Defining Cream. Um, I was telling her that I was in transition, in a transitioning phase of growing my hair from relaxed to natural. And I was telling her that I want to wear my hair in like twists or um, I don't know what you call them but she um, gave me this to try and she said just put some on my finger while my hair is wet kind of twirl it around so I'm gonna try that to see what happens even though the ends of my hair is straight from it being relaxed um, I'm hoping that I can maybe retain some kind of um, texture or twirl from this so I'm really excited to try that and then she just gave me two samples of the um, nourish and shine which um, I purchased the big one of so yeah I'm excited to try all these um, Jane Carter solution products then the next vendor I stopped at was Moroccan oil now, I don't know if you guys have ever heard of Moroccan oil but I've heard of it a lot in um, uh, let's be politically correct the Caucasian salons and I've heard a lot of Caucasian women speaking about Moroccan oil and I'm like what is this Moroccan oil stuff so I finally stopped by the booth that they had and I picked up my own um, bottle of Moroccan oil now this is a daily 
oil treatment. It's kind of like a shine serum, but what it says is, well, it says oil treatment for all types of hair. Moroccan oil has unique quality of instant absorption into the hair, creating an instant shine and long-term conditioning without leaving residue. Directions. For healthy looking, smooth, and strikingly shiny hair, apply a small amount throughout damp hair and style as usual. Now, in the bag, this bag that they gave me, they gave me a couple of samples of Moroccan oil, which I have been trying out before I use this. I use this stuff every single day, and I love it. I love the shine that it gives my hair, and it doesn't weigh my hair down. I know my hair and scalp is really thirsty because when I put it on, it just it just draws it right up and bonds right to my hair. It's not heavy. My hair still bounces. I love this stuff. So I figured before I use my brand new bottle, I'm just going to use my samples. They tell me this retails in the store for $50. Being that the show um, was open, was only for professionals, you had to either be a student or professional, everything was pretty much um, professionally discounted. So I got this bottle, and I'll show you the size of it. I got this size bottle, which retails in the store for $50 for $20, and it came with a pump. Now, while I was there, I also noticed that they had blow-drying brushes. So I just purchased two um, thermal blow-drying brushes. I love these for my hair. It gives my hair a lot of volume when I'm blow-drying my hair. What I also love about it is that if you take this little orange thing out of the bottom, it comes with a pick. So you can actually part the hair while you're drying it love them love them love them um if any of you are interested in just going to check out moroccan oil i'm sure you can find them at moroccanoil.com um, the day of the show these brushes were ten dollars a piece so i just got um sorry guys the medium sized one and the large one so that is what I got from Moroccan Oil. Moving right along. Look at this, y'all. When y'all see this, you're going to be like, oh my God, that is so you. Look at this. It's an apron, and it has Hello Kitty on the front and two pair of scissors. When I saw this, I was like, I know you guys probably can't see this. I was like, oh my gosh, I have to to have that and it was only twenty dollars and here is a um love your hair button from the jane carter solution so i thought that was so cute and so me like i have to have that so i'm gonna keep this on for the duration of the video not like you guys can see it anyway okay so i think that pretty much takes care of um everything i got for hair oh you know what really quick i i stopped at Harmon's also and I got a couple hair products. Um, my director swears by Paul Mitchell. So I got a couple Paul Mitchell products that I wanted to try. I got this clarifying shampoo. He tells me that this shampoo removes any buildup that you might have. Buildup build up of products. He said it even might strip temporary color. And I'm actually trying to lift some of this black off of my hair. So I'm really interested in trying this. Then I purchased a detangling um, conditioner, and then I purchased um, a leave-in moisturizer. So I'm really excited to try out these um, new Paul Mitchell products. All right, so that's it for the hair. I just want to move through this really quickly because my time is going. Okay, so you guys know that I've been on this nail thing lately, this nail art, nail design thing that's another aspect of my career that I want to explore. And if you guys haven't seen yet, this is my latest design, my 3D flowers. So um, I picked up some nail items. So I'm just going to go through these really, really quickly. From this company called um, Lee Chat. I picked up two sets of colored acrylic. One is in pastels, and the other one is in, um, these are all your primary colors, and these are all the, it says savory collection, sweet and savory, but these are all pastel colors. And inside of this comes with um, a liquid monomer, which is the stuff that you use to make the acrylic wet. 
So this was buy one, get one half off. This was $30. Was it $30 or $35? I don't remember, but I think I got them both for $45. And I Googled them, and they are a really, really high-end brand of nail supplies. So I'm really excited to try those two items. Then I um, stopped at another booth by Starlight Nails, and I've actually seen them before online. They have a website. They're located in California, and I got a couple things from them. I'm just going to run through really quick what I purchased from them. I got a couple nail art pens. Um, these might look a little similar to colors that I might have, but the tones are nothing like anything that I have in my collection. Um, then I purchased, um, there's another one, so I purchased four of those. Then I got a Kalinske brush, which I'm really excited about because I needed a very precise Kalinske brush to do my 3D nail art with. So, um, and this brush is in number six. So if any of you guys are interested in trying to dabble into um, 3D nail art or just um, using acrylic period, Kalinske brushes are the best ones. Number eight brush is probably the best for applying acrylic and numbers two, four, and six are the best ones to use for your nail art. All right, then I got some dotting tools, which I'm really excited about. I got one in every size. Then I got these, um, I can't even explain them. They're like decals, like stars and moons and um, like metallic decals to go on the nails. And then I saw these little Hello Kitty things. I'm like, those things are way too big to put on a nail. So you know your girl's probably going to stick them on some on a palette or something like that. So I got those three items. And then um, I thought I had one more thing. I did have one more thing. Um, and then I purchased this. This is a set of colored acrylic. Now, I actually saw Starlight Nails before I saw Lee Chat. So, yeah, I purchased two of the same thing, and I was a little upset about that. When I finish with this haul, you're really going to be like, oh, my God, girl, what is wrong with you? All right, so that's what I got from them. So the next place I stopped at was IBD, and IBD is the company that makes the gels that I was using. They came out with a gel lac, just like the shellac, if you guys know what I'm talking about. It's it's All it is is it's... um. It's gel, gel, gel nail polish, and it's soak off gel nail polish, if you guys can see. So it's a little bit thicker than your normal nail polish, but it's gel, and you need a UV lamp to use it, and it soaks off. So I just got three colors. I got a green, a hot pink, and a light pink, and then I got black. And then I just got this little spatula to use for my 3D nail art. So that's all I got from IBD. Now, on to what I'm really, really, really excited about. Can you guys see that? Minx. Yes, I am now officially a Minx nail tech, which I'm so super duper excited about. I got the entire Minx nail system. Now this thing is too big for me to pull out, so what I'm just going to do is at the end, I'll show you pictures of what the kit looks like. And these are the Minx systems, the, the, the Minx nail decals that I purchased. Well, they came with the kit. Not I me, mean, not came with the kit, but you know what I mean. So these are all the Minx um, nail decals that I purchased, along with the entire setup to actually apply the Minx nail system. Now, um, some of you guys might ask me, well, how do you get that? Or Sorry, how do you guys. Go? Um, anyway, like I was saying, some of you might ask me, how do you go and purchase um, one of those kits? But you can't. You have to have a cosmetology license or be a student in order to pur purchase the kit. Now, if you know somebody around you who does them, you can get your nails done. But as far as purchasing the kit, you have to be a professional for that. So for any of you cosmetologists out there who are interested in trying um, your, uh, you know, trying your hand in uh, Mink's nail art system, look them up. All right. So I just have one more haul to go, and then I am done. All right. So my next haul came from uh, BeautyFactory.com. Now in this box 
is filled with a bunch of nail supplies. If you guys have checked out my sale video, you'll see that I was selling my nail drill and my UV light, and this is why. Okay, so let's start with this. Um, I was just telling you guys about the Kalinsky brushes that are good for your, um, you know, your acrylic. So I purchased every single one, two, four, six, eight, and ten. Um, and then they gave me free these little nail tips. And then for these, I got, they are reusable nail forms. You know how you want to sculpt the nail or you want to make your nail longer? This is what these are for. And they are reusable. I thought that, oh, excuse me, I thought that was really cool. And then I got a set of dotting tools. Now these are a little bit smaller than the dotting tools that I just showed you previously, which I'm really happy about because I was starting to think that I got, um, I got the same thing, but I didn't, so I'm really happy about that. Then, uh, I purchased a 36 watt UV lamp. So not only does this lamp have more wattages than the 9 watts, it actually can fit two hands. Now some of you might say, well Kenya, what's the difference between a 36 watt and a 9 watt? Drying time. The 9 watt will, will definitely work for your normal basic um, whatever you're doing, but this will dry your nails or cure your nails in half the time because it's what triple, quadruple the power. So yeah, I purchased that. Then I got these, which I thought were so super cool. Okay, let me tell you what these things are. These are little things. I'm going to open them. You know how you want to soak off your acrylic and you have to stick your hand in something? You don't have to do that with these. You fill them up with um, acetone. They're acetone resistant. And you stick your finger in the thing and just have your fingers in there. So instead of wetting up your whole entire hand or sticking your hand in something, you can walk around with these on. And they are um, leak proof. The seal is intense. It's wrapped around my finger so freaking tight. Oh my gosh, how neat is that? I was so excited when I saw those. I was like, okay, I have to have those. Then I purchased the 18 set color acrylic. Yeah, I know. I know. Don't even say it. I, I, I really bumped my head on that one. But last but not least, I got a professional drill set. So unlike the drill that I had in my haul, this is actually the same drill that they use in the nail salon. So if I can get this open, I will just show you guys what it looks like. Oh my gosh, how cool is that? Oh my gosh, look at that. It comes with so many packs of your nail drill bit files this is what the oh, if I can get it out this is the size of the actual drill okay these are all your drill bits that come with it love it this is your stand oh these are extra drill bits wow because these are your standard drill bits just like the one that came in the other one and I'm taking that this is my gun. Oh my gosh! Oh, I'm so excited! And it's pink! <laughs> I am so excited. Uh, you know what? The one thing that I was regretting about giving up my drill was the fact that it was pink and I wanted to keep it. But look, this is pink too. Now, I paid $66 for this drill. I saw this at the show. The cheapest one was $125. I was like, no thank you. I'll just wait for the one that I have coming in the mail. So, um, yeah, guys, I believe that is it for this, like, super crazy, crazy haulage. Oh, I got this free. This is just a set of um, UV gel that came with the, um, the lamp, which was pretty cool. I thought that was really cool. So when you buy a lamp, you get this for free. It's like, oh, okay, cool. Um, I see my time tick ticking away. Uh, yeah, I knew this was going to be a long video. But yeah, I think that is it. So, with that being done, you guys know you can expect some serious, serious nail stuff going on up in here. So, I'm definitely going to start doing more nail tutorials because I've been trying to get my skills up, trying to 
you know, I just got my hands in everything, y'all. And I am really excited. So I will keep you guys posted every single step of the way with everything that I'm doing. If you have any questions about any of the items that I just showed you, please don't hesitate to ask. I know I'm kind of going fast now because my time is ticking. But yes, please, if you have any questions, you want to know about something, how to do something, if you want me to, if you want to request something, you know your girl's always open for that. Um, I just want to apologize really quick to any of you ladies who have left me inbox sister to sister messages. I am definitely going to get to them. Um, if any of you guys know my prior sister to sister sessions, I don't like to just jump into a message when it's sent. Sometimes, depending on the situation, I like to kind of think about it and, you know, put myself in the position of what would I do, maybe get my husband's advice. That way I can give you the best advice that I possibly can give you because there's nothing worse than getting bad advice. And I try by all means not to do that. So I definitely have some sister to sister segments coming up. Y'all, I just got a large amount of stuff coming up. So if you guys want to stick around with your girl and see all the stuff that I got going on and my crazy you guys are probably like how do you fit all that stuff in that head y'all see how big this head is this head can fit a lot of information in it but I don't know I just when I get excited about stuff when I'm passionate about stuff I make the time I mean this is my career this is my well, my second career this is what I want to do so anything that's worth having is worth sacrificing for whether it be a couple hours of sleep some research anything so anyway enough said I'm gonna go so I can get these videos out to you guys because it doesn't make any sense to have these videos if y'all can't see them right deuces love you guys